there's a lot of food too. I'm so excited to see all this food. Salisbury steak, not just like hamburger patties. The octopus. That's heavy too. Yeah. Fifteen thousand. A lot of food. It's heavy. This is very heavy. That's how vendors attract um, customers here. It's just loud music, dancing vendors, and um, pyro. They got me there. Anything with fire. People will come to you. <laughs> good marketing company. What's good about this? The octopus is cooked right. It's very tender. I don't know. After this, we may stop right here. <laughs> good. This is so heavy. There's a lot of. This is a lot of food. So this is our third our food for the night. This is mandu or Korean dumplings. This is pork, um, abalone. No, I think pork and abalone. Pork and abalone and um, octopus. One of it is octopus. They're five or ten thousand won. It's so hot. Head on fire. I'm telling you, like they get everyone with fire. Uh, fire, every stall has fire. Yes. <laughs> it sells the food. Oh, is it spicy? Straight in the trash. <laughs> and maybe had like a quarter of one eaten and then like ah, that's garbage. Yeah, I don't understand who love it. Um, me, I just got it so that way I know what I'm eating. Like, because oh, it's my first time, and I've never had tangholo before. And I've seen a lot of people like going crazy about it, like on Instagram, like, oh, I had tangholo in Korea. 
But actually, Tanghulu originated in China and it got very popular here in Korea. My first Tanghulu is a gelato, it's um, mango gelato. But at least I ate the, um, the gelato, the whole gelato, and just broke the, um, the sugar coating. But I will not gonna eat um, or buy Tanghulu again ever. All right, cheers. This is the last food for the night. Too. A lot of food. A hamburger is filling. A hamburger is fatty. It's our last night in Jeju Island. Flying back to Seoul tomorrow. I said we need to do the photo booth, baby. Down here. It should be open. Take your picture up there and then everyone who comes in, I will see you in Jeju. Korean hotels has, you know, slippers. You're gonna use this shower shoes while taking a shower because they don't have shower curtain. And the towel is small. Can you spread this? Show how small this towel. Ta-da! That's it. That's their bath towel here in Korea. Chad has to use two of them. <laughs> I'm videoing you, so you have you have proof that you have something <laughs> to, do. to do. I did all the packing actually, thanks to myself. <laughs> so last day in Jeju, we are gonna fly out in back to Seoul. I'm wondering if you're gonna have some breakfast or sausage. Yep. There's a lot of people yesterday downstairs in the breakfast hall. Mm -hmm. I had two of us, yeah. Yeah. I got different sausages. This looks like a rainbow sausage. <laughs> We have different sausages, kimchi, Korean beef. Oh, I didn't try yesterday because there's a lot of people and there's a long line of the door. Mm -hmm. I told Chad that we should do that zip line. He don't want to do it with me. He got, he got lucky because yesterday it was raining and the zipline was closed. So. <laughs> Thank you. 
So you get this um, two hundred dollars um, sunglasses, but he doesn't want to wear it right now. He's like, okay, I'm gonna wear my Ray Bans. You gotta wear them part time. Oh, just part time. Yeah, it's just like your nice car, you know. You take your nice car out on the weekends, or you know, when you want to ball out, and go out to dinner. Okay. You don't drive it every day. It's not your daily. No. <laughs> That's how you get the use out of it. That's your daily. So this is your beater. Yeah, this is my beater. My Ray-Ban beaters. And my daily. And then you got your glasses that you... Going out. That you put on. Mm -hmm. 